Hey everybody, welcome back to Nordhagen Beach. This is episode four. Thank you everybody for all your recent love and support. And if you enjoy our content, don't forget to like and subscribe. Feel free to check out the links in our description to our Discord. Come on in, say hi to everybody. Uh, post your content, doesn't have to be related to anything we're playing. So, let's get started here. So we've kind of, sort of, been working on this, and this is about all the further we made it, and I think I'm just going to leave this building for now. Um, start working on the other one, just because I'm not sure how to decorate this place. This was going to be our, like, post office slash, uh, like, library, magazine type place. But I'm not so sure about that now. Uh, I had asked, you know, uh, in the first episode, you know, what some some more of the, you know, buildings that they would have had. And thank you to those who provided suggestions because I really was stuck. Um, and one of those people commented that the post office would have been in the general store. Um, you know, like you would have just come in and bought your supplies and picked up your mail all at the same time. Um, so we may or may not go that route. I haven't really decided yet. I also um, looked up some old images, you know, online for some historical Western places and, <clears throat> excuse me. And, um, you know, so that gave me some, some more ideas on a build. And what I thought was funny is there's a lot of buildings like this that have like a slanted roof towards the back um, and then, you know, flat roofs. And, you know, you see a lot of that in like what Old West movies, especially the flat roofs with like, you know, the enemies or even the townspeople up on the roof shooting down. Um, but I found some pictures that actually they had sloped roofs that, you know, just joined together. Um, you know, like this one would have had a slope, this one would have had a slope, this one would have had a slope, and they just kind of all joined together, like with no way to drain, I guess, you know, water just sits in the middle slopes. At first I thought maybe there was like a small gap between the buildings, but I actually, on some of the pictures that I found, there was not one. They were literally joined. Um, so we'll probably do a couple that way, uh, you know, and do some flat roofs. All right. So let's go ahead and figure out um, we're just going to leave this one up in the air for right now. So let's make this one the, the general store. Uh, first we need to go find a counter. Do I want to use one of these, or do I want to kind of stick with this old... These kind of older looking... I think I want to stick with these kind of older looking counters. They wouldn't have had... I mean, granted, this isn't like realistically the West. I mean, this is still, you know, Fallout Universe, and the settler found a bunch of books about the West. But we're gonna, we're gonna try to keep it with like, you know, wooden counters and stuff, and not the metal ones with glass. Um, let's see, I think I got that one in do-it-yourself. Which would be in furniture, not structures. Uh, we're gonna stick with post-war. Yeah, I did. Okay, it's right here. Um would make it kind of matchy-matchy if we just did this everywhere, but... Um, or do we want this on this side since the door's on this side? I think we do. Back door. No, don't. No, no, no. Don't, no, don't do that. Stop. Alright, fine. 
just want you to let me place you where I want you. Gotta make sure that there's gonna be enough room when they come in to also... Um, you know, have like a stool or something back here. Maybe some shelves of stuff that you have to ask for. I'd like to be able to fit another one in right here. I don't know if that's going to leave enough room for the settler. Unless we push everything back, but I don't want to take up too much of the real estate out here. not take the floor. Oh, I mean, I can get through there, but... Um... Alright, let's move this back this way some more. I feel like it's crooked a little bit still. I still didn't give them any more room, but <laughs> that does make it awfully tight, though. So we need to put this in a different spot. so crooked. We gotta fix that first. Oh, slow down. Slow down. Now what did that do over here? It push us back, so it's, uh... It's pretty seamless. Um, there. It gives them a little bit of room, and we'll just have to make sure the door opens the correct way so that's not clipping into here. Um, or even potentially, we could take this out and put the door here and a half wall here. So maybe we'll do that. Since I decided to go that route with the counter. Whoops, I have my object snap off, don't I? There we go. That's better. Um, and then we want... Not that one. That one. 
there we go. We still gotta make sure the door opens the way we want it, but at least that's more like in line with this, I guess. Let's go back to do it yourself. Um I mean I'd like to be able to use these, but I don't know if that fits with the whole theme that we're going with, so I don't think we will. Fridges, huh? Okay. I mean, I guess that's kind of it, huh? I want to start that from over here. Oops. Alright, so that's what I was afraid that was going to clip out there, but that's alright, we can do something else right here in the corner. Do we do another row of shelves in the middle, or do we do something more like this? Or even little tables like this? Maybe. These ones are metal, but... I mean, it's crooked, but... <laughs> better. Now, the question is, do we come this way some more? I think so. Yeah, I think that's, that's good. part all open. Um, what else do we have? Maybe do some of these in front of the window? a 
little bit, just because I don't want it to seem like you can't get to that stuff in the corner. Maybe we can put like a little basket of something right there. Uh, and then maybe one of these square ones right here. Um, except for I think I want it to maybe be like in a corner. Actually, you know what? I have a different idea for that. So we'll hold off on that. Alright, so this is our general store. Sorry, I'm just nitpicking now. It's fine. Um, Alright, so let's get um, some food and stuff up here. Oh, I don't have snap on. beer. Put some of that up there. I don't know if there was any half ones of those. like dirty water and stuff. stuff. Maybe we'll put it out here instead. it for that type of stuff, eh? Other than the lunch boxes, which I don't think we're gonna put out. Hold on. Uh, 
Okay, so hold on. I think this probably... Nope. I just need that. There we go. Why does that look like it has... I don't know. Oh, I know why. towels. this one. Sure. Put that up there. Fine there. <laughs> All right, we need some somewhere to put recreational stuff. Oh, well, on the floor there works just fine for me. That's too bad. Come on, just go underneath there. Please? Can you please? Um, yeah, we gotta have some toys. get some more stuff from some of the other I actually want these back here Do we want anything else for that while I'm here Extra stock of stuff here. Alright, I know there's some clutter that'll snap to those other places, so. Um, I feel like there should have. Wasn't there. Hold on, wasn't there like teddy bears somewhere? I thought I saw. 
I like ran across them randomly. They weren't in library and storage for some odd weird reason, were they? I felt like I came across them while we were looking for... Oh, maybe it was in decoration. Yeah, there we go. store. Um, alright, let's put that there. Put that there. Let's see, if, I, even if I just have to, like, set them down there manually, that's fine. Let's turn our object snapping off. Uh, oh, those are sitting way high. Oh, and I guess I'm gonna have to turn my surface snap off too then. <laughs> do they look like they're just sitting there? They do, that's fine. Alright. What else do we got for decoration? Put that up there. I mean, those are books on gardening, maybe. that are not uh, electric. I think, was that in... Was that in decorations? Lights? I mean, we've got these, but... need them on chains though. I also don't like that they're swinging in here. That makes sense outside, but not in here. Uh, whoops, there's a table there. Uh, you know, that makes sense out here for them to be swinging. I guess we can go ahead and why are you trying to pop up that high? I guess because of the doorway. Just put one in the middle of all of these or the approximate middle. a couple of them, but that's fine. Oh. I don't really like the light those give off, though. The, like, foggy light. But we'll make it work. Um... are gonna get off, but 
kind of light we want in here. So let's go see what else we can find. So no, not those either. Here's where all maybe not though, we'll look through them. I think these are all powered, yeah. better even though I can't turn this on in here let's go ahead and get a radio in here CBC had a well. Uh, let's put one of these out here. Just for now. Uh, hold on. And they have a windmill tower, so let's go ahead and put that there for a minute. Alright. Lights. We were trying to find- whoops. We were trying to find lights. lights in here. Is it resources? Yeah, there is. What is that? 
Oh, a wind turbine. Okay. So hold on, is that the only only lights they have? side kind of like those Just put them there for now figure out how I want them placed later um well then uh, you don't have lights do you if you do they're probably electric actually That's right. Um, I think these gave off weird light. I, you know, like that. It has too much flare. But maybe if we did the. Let's see what we think of the E. So at least bring some light. If I like them, I am going to get some hooks, though, to put them on. That's actually not too bad. Oh, ah, that one's not even connected. Yeah, I think I like that amount of light. And it's not giving off the weird light flare either. Um, I had tried to use these. They're still swinging, but... Other than a stationary lamp that you set on the, um, you know, counter, I don't know if we're going to find any that don't swing. I felt like there was some. That's not too bad. I think that's an appropriate amount of light. Um, Alright, well that is the general store partially done. What are we going to put here? Maybe we'll put the clothing store here, I think. Let's go ahead and make it daytime.
because it turned out cute. So yeah, if we make that the clothing store... Who are you? Hey, I just wanted to introduce myself. I heard your radio beep, so I figured, why not? I wanted to personally thank you for giving us this opportunity. I'm ready to help with whatever you need. Just say the word. Uh, sure. Uh, except for... Uh, yeah. yeah. Let me show you. Go ahead. I, I don't really have anything for you to do. I don't think, but... Can you come help with... with... food? And I'm pretty sure these are all assigned, but... And you're gone again already, aren't you? <sighs> well, we could get a general... Uh, let's get a mat down here real quick. Hopefully he'll... he'll hang on for long enough for me to do that. Um, uh, da 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 da. Let's see where, where the USO has the invisible mats, I think. Yes. Uh, is it Trader? Yeah, that would be what we would. And then it's going to do the things with the caps, huh? Ah, oh, it still let me do it anyway, though. Good enough. Alright. And you're gone. <laughs> this place is super buggy. Um, I bet you I don't have a caravanner here now, either. That's the wrong button. Uh, show supply lines. Yeah, see, at the end of the last episode... I, like, assign somebody as... And why... I have not been to Croup Manor. Why does it think I have somebody at Croup Manor? Grey Garden to... Somerville, which is correct. Grey Garden to Heyman's Alley. And yeah, Grey Garden to Croup Manor, like, should not exist. That kind of bothers me. We'll see when we actually put up a beacon. Maybe that will uh, fix that. I mean, which I guess we'll have to have quote unquote electricity for that. <laughs> That windmill is that providing electricity or water? It's producing power. All right. Well, that's fine. We're go we're gonna pretend it's producing water instead. There might actually be um, a water one somewhere. If I look through, but I think they're actually all powered. Pretty sure it's the same guy too, like the same looking 
die every time as well. Okay, well, I think this is where we're going to call this episode. I do want to save some decorating for... Um, you know, the final reveal. So... I believe that this is where I will leave you. Thank you very much for watching. Um, don't forget to like and sub subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Bye!